That was breaking overnight. News 4 learned new details about a Webster Groves police officer shot on the interstate. Police say that the shooting happened on the westbound lanes of Interstate 44 near South Elm Avenue exit. The suspect is dead. News 4's Justin Andrews joins us with the newest details and what we're learning this morning. Good morning, Justin. Good morning, Mo. The officer, 36 years old, brought here to the ER after he was shot multiple times on the interstate while responding to a stranded driver. That information coming straight from lead investigators overnight. Video now playing of the packed police presence last night outside the hospital here at Barnes Jewish Hospital. News 4 counted at least two dozen police squad cars. A pretty typical response when an area officer is shot. All right, so let's go back to the interstate shooting scene now. This all unfolding around 830 last night. Webster Groves PD got a call of a stranded driver on westbound 44 near the Elm exit. Police say two officers arrived there separately, one to aid the driver, the other to block traffic. One of the officers got out to help the driver, and that's when detectives say the driver started shooting at the officer. The officer shot back. Bullets hit both of them multiple times, killing the suspect. I'm confident that uh, we will be able to, to uh, uh, do a thorough investigation and, and uh, determine exactly what happened. but. We are fortunate, um, you know, it's always tragic when any loss, any life is lost, but it is a blessing that the officer survived. Uh, um, uh, you know, our prayers are, are, are with him and his family. Now, the officer has been a law enforcement for about seven years. His condition is listed as stable this morning, but there is something that this officer did that probably saved his life. I'll detail that coming up in the next 30 minutes. We are live outside Barnes Jewish Hospital this morning. I'm Justin Andrews, News 4.